Alright, this is going to be a fun project today. Um, this is one that, as a child, we didn't have all this Call of Duty, PlayStation 4 coming out. Um, you know, anyway. So, it was either skateboarding, it was roller hockey in the middle of the street. We had a Nintendo 64, but, eh, let's just face it, Nintendo 64 wasn't that good. So, we came up with ideas, um, and today I'm going to show you what we came up with as kids. We are going to be making our own... Uh, BB gun slash airsoft gun out of a two liter bottle and you have two different choices go through a detailed step-by-step -step with the coke uh, two liter bottle here but you have two different sizes if you want all we're going to need is we're just going to need the neck of it so you can either have kind of a thinner one or a wider one so first thing you do is you obviously drink your uh, beverage of choice you're going to unscrew the cap here get rid of that we don't need that and what we do here is we're going to grab our scissors or a razor blade and you want to pierce through the bottle right here. Um, it depends how long you want it, we can always cut it down later, but for right now let's just pierce through about, about right there. So now what we're going to do, we're going to slip our scissors in that cut and we're going to cut all the way around it. And please be careful if you're a young kid, don't get in trouble by your parents. I'm 31 years old, so I'm still a big kid. All right, so for this one, we don't really like all this kind of sharp edge here, so we're gonna smooth that out a little bit here. Make it look a little bit better for the, uh, you know, if you don't really mind, then hey, you're all done uh, with that portion, but I'm gonna make mine look a little nicer, little rounder edges. Okay, so that is trash. And now what we're going to do here is there's a little water inside from after I drank the uh, Coke. I washed it out with water because I don't want sticky inside, you know, sticky Coke. So let's wipe that water off there. Okay, the next thing you do is you take a balloon. And if you don't know where to get balloons, Obviously, there's plenty of stores that sell balloons, but I will have a link in the description box if you want to just order up a pack of balloons. Just one will do, but if you're going to make several of them, then of course you need more. So, okay, what you want to do is you want to take your spout here, and what we're going to do is we're going to put the end of this balloon, where you blow it up with your you know, mouth, you would a balloon, we're going to put this all the way on top right here. And what we want to do is we want to slip it down because we want to get rid of this neck because our BB is going to get caught in the neck. So we want to put it all the way on top. So the best thing to do is just open it up with your thumbs like this. And this is going to be a little tricky, but it'll be all right. So you're going to open it up like this with your thumbs. And you're going to put it over the top. And you want to get it all the way over the bottom lip here. Okay, so... We want to continue to maneuver it. Again, try not to rip your balloon. Okay, so now that it's all the way over, of course, our shooter is totally not centered. So we want to continue to slide. And remember, try not to rip your balloon. That's why you've bought more balloons than one. And we're going to keep coming down until we get rid of our lip. And so let's open up our balloon. We've still got to go more. So let me do that more and I'll show you the end product here. Okay, and this is what we want right here, exactly as shown. So it's all the way down, you have no lip, it's completely centered, and so when we go to cock it back, there's not going to be any interference, okay? And so what we're going to do here is we're going to lock down that area there just so that it doesn't um, you know, mess with us as we um, are continuing to pull back because your fingers are going to suppress it a little bit but we want to lock it down even more. So what I've done is I've taken two zip ties here and here. I've inserted one and the other one here, and so it's going to wrap around, make it a little bit longer one. One big one will do, but I like two small ones, and I'll show you why. So let's put that on right on the end here so that our uh, balloon won't uh, shove off and uh, come back at us there. So get that zip tie going in here. Okay, what we're going to do here now is we need to tighten it completely up. So let's continue to pull that side there until it's nice and, nice and tight. This side's tight. 
Now what you're going to do is take your scissors without cutting your balloon and clip off those ends there. Again, be very careful not to cut your balloon. Okay, now with those little shreds out of the way, we have our zip tie on top, right? Keep our balloon nice and straight, and you can even use these as little siding tools if you want, but we're gonna go even better than that. We're gonna take a nice red Sharpie marker, and this is gonna be our sights. So we're just gonna fill in right in the middle here. We're gonna fill in there and there. This will be our impact zone right there. That's gonna be our sights with red marker. Okay, so this is our look right here. We've got our sights lined up with our red sights. We put our BB, I'm going to show you right now. Right now we're going to put in our um, heavyweight uh, airsoft gun um, BBs. Um, I don't have any real BBs for BB guns around the house, but uh, again, this is for a BB gun or airsoft gun. So I'm going to stick with the airsoft BBs right now. So let's load it up. Okay, and all you do here is you have your balloon and your cylinder. And it's as simple as dropping the BB inside the cylinder. So now it's all the way in the balloon here. As you cock it back here, your BB is going to be right between your fingers here. So right now I'm filling the BB between my fingers in the balloon here. So again, you cock it back, lean on your sights. Whoa, geez, that ricocheted back at me. Let's see if we can, I think I hit the stool. All right, check this one out. I'm going to go for the uh, bottom center. And obviously with the balloon, the elasticity, you can pull it back even further for more quickness, or you can just kind of lob it. It's up to you. But, I mean, the more you stretch it, the more fast it's going to go. So let's put some heat on this one. I'm going to crank this one out real good here. Finish him. All right, let's finish it off. Yes, that cracked it. Oh my goodness. Look at that shot. Look at that kill. And again, a technique for pulling it straight back. This is going to go straight. Not this, not this, not this, not this. You pull it straight back, it's going to shoot straight. Because the BB is in these fingers right here. So you're just going to pull it straight back and it's going to shoot straight. So let's pull this back and let's finish these cups off. Wow, that was fast. That right there, my friends, is your airsoft gun, your BB gun, in a two-liter bottle here with your sights and everything. You can get more Pacific if you want to paint it, make it look all nice, get a different balloon, a little bit more stretching the back, more aerodynamic. You know, you can mess around with it, but this is kind of the basic model. But if you guys make your own, um, send me some video responses and let me know in the comment section below to check out yours. And I want to see what you guys do differently in terms of your design. Right on guys, hope you enjoy this, and again, please, if you're um, under the age of 18, just be careful, don't get in trouble by your parents, don't put holes in the wall, I think I put some chips in my wall, but be careful, don't hit your TV over here, don't hit your speakers, just be careful, don't hit your sisters and brothers, uh, wear masks and helmets, and, uh, and just shoot each other, have a good time. Well, don't shoot each other, but like, you know, well, just go easy on each other. And I'll have a link in the description box where you can pick up your own BBs or uh, regular BBs. But again, uh, check with your parents if you're underage because I don't want to get in trouble. All right, guys. Cool. Enjoy. And again, check out...